Hey, what's up YouTube? Today I'm gonna go over the differences between hot shot versus semi trucking. There are always questions about whether people should buy a hot shot or a semi. So today I'm gonna go over a couple of the differences in buying a hot shot or semi. So for the hot shot purposes, I'm gonna go over buying a new hot shot because I think most people to get in a hot shot truck and buy a new hot shot and a new trailer, not all the time, but most people, and most people get in a semi truck and buy a used semi. So the semi portion is gonna be based off of a used truck. So for startup costs, a new truck, like a Dodge Ram 3500 is gonna run you around 60,000 to buy a brand new. The trailer is gonna be around 14,000 for a 40 foot gooseneck trailer for a total of $74,000 for your truck and trailer to get started in hot shot trucking. Over here in semi trucking for a good used truck is gonna cost you about $80,000 and $20,000 for a good used trailer for a total of $100,000. So we have 74,000 compared to 100,000. And it's the 74,000 is of course for a brand new truck and trailer. Monthly revenue for the hot shot on the high end, we have $28,000 per month. That is on the high end. Of course, we all know trucking, your revenue is gonna vary month to month. But on the high end for a step deck or flatbed bed trailer, we're gonna have $40,000 per month. Operating costs. Maintenance of fuel can vary greatly from month to month, but lower than a semi. So you're gonna save on maintenance and fuel by having a hot shot. On a semi, it's gonna vary considerably, but it's gonna be much more for maintenance and fuel than a hot shot truck. Also, weight that can be scaled. A hot shot, the average hot shot can scale about 20,000 pounds. For a semi, the average is gonna be about 48,000 pounds. So at the end of the day, it just matters when it comes to personal preference. That's what I would say, because um, there's positives about the hot shot trucking and there's positives about semi trucking. One thing I like to tell people too, you have to realize if you do get a hot shot, say you get a load that's paying $1,200. If that same load went on a semi, most of the time they're gonna pay that semi $1,200 to haul that load too. If it's $3 a mile and you put it on your hot shot, if, that a semi is gonna get it for that same $3 a mile, but on a hot shot, you have less expenses. So the rates are typically the same, whether you have a hot shot or a semi, but with a semi being able to scale more weight than a hot shot, you're gonna have more options because you can put more weight on that trailer. So at the end of the day, it's personal preference. Um, you have to base it off um, your finances and how much you're willing to spend to get started. Hey, thank you for watching my video. Make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.